Well, this camera has much better audio, but always shut the self off. This camera, it's okay. You know, it's focus is a little off. It has a couple dead pixels, a couple smudges, but nothing I can't work around. Um, so. I figured I'd ever do some filming around instead of doing nothing all day. Because I haven't done an actual sit down or a actual vlog type video. Or um, a day in the life type video. So, in a while. So, might as well do that. And I have to clean my lens off though. Because it looks pretty crappy. And, yeah. So, put all these in the best. Not really my problem, but I'll do what I can. So yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, it's morning, and uh, yeah, it's been a few nights and probably a pretty good night's rest. Um, I can't see too well. Well, I don't know what we'll do today, but I'll find something to do. I figured I'd record for an intro for this morning because I just woke up and, um, yeah, might make breakfast and do crack things what else. Fine, I'll find something to do today, but I don't know what that's going to be, so stay tuned and I'll hopefully find something. So, um, I have brushed up, I have done my hair, and it looks getting a little bit clearer today. There. See that blue? Yeah, so it's a little bit clearing there. And for those of you who haven't seen my, been on my channel in a while, this is my new computer I bought with my own cash. For the last couple of years, I've had a HP desktop. But the video editing quality of the machine started to run thin, so I had a choice. Either buy an iMac or buy a, a PC desktop. Went for an iMac. And it's a good computer. It has really nice keyboard travel. And the layout of Mac OS is a little bit different from usual. For those of you who are like me and really want a Mac, an iMac, you know, these computers are really worth it. You know, plays back YouTube videos. Really nice. Not, it does have a fusion drive, so. Uh, so. Which makes it a little bit slower. But the thing, it does have Radeon Pro graphics. This isn't a tech channel, so I'm not going to go too far in depth on that, but. I still be doing a lot of my editing with. From here on out. So I'll put that to sleep for now. The only downside, the only way to put this thing to sleep is to use the mouse and go up here and do it. So yeah, but besides that, I want to get back up, up the pace with you guys and talk about what's cooking and what's been going on outside of the channel in general. And I've got a counter here at six day or six mo months until my uh, South Carolina vacation, and I got 79 days till Christmas. And counting. So, I just see I got my schedule up there for Walmart. I'm going to have to get another one, though, because I'm on the end of it. So, yeah. Yep. Don't think we're going to need that anymore. 
for the season. So I've got a few trees marked out here. As you can see, the little orange dots on them. I should I show up on camera? Yeah, you can see that. Yeah, there we are. We're going to cut those trees down in a few months. It's supposed to anyway. And the grass has been nothing but dead this year, so we're going to have to take care of that too. By we, I mean whoever's going to come and do it. Uh, so I have some news to give. So my dog, after nine years, has, has died. Now, uh, what happened was she had, um, she had uh, a, lot of, a lot of problems. Kidneys and her uh, urinary tract infection. And yeah, they, they put her down a few days ago. And I gotta tell you, it was really difficult dealing with that. But you gotta know that when you're not in good shape, you have a shorter lifespan. A much shorter lifespan, so. But we do have, you know who? But I just thought I'd point that out because some of you guys might be asking, hey, where's your dog? Well, I'll see her in those 75 years, if you know what I mean by that. But in the meantime, we've gotta keep pushing forward. So, I have nothing to do today, outside of um, my usual stuff. Uh, the yard is going to look pretty different with these trees gone. So these trees, and that the couple, three of those trees over there, are going to be removed from the yard. Apologize for my quality of the video is crap again. Might get another one of these sometime, with DSLR cameras. Might maybe a more expensive one, I don't know yet. a squirrel <laughs> and uh, yeah of course it'll be quieter around here with the dog not around but I rather doesn't really didn't really matter anyway my dog was kind of like a daughter to me so it's why it was so hard to, when it lost came but you know maybe now I can get some peace and quiet around here um so I'm going to have to leaf blow this up, find a new leaf blower I got, I might feel myself doing that. What are you doing kitty kitty, huh? Hey kitty kitty. There's a lot that's going to be changing, but yet things are going to stay the same. Um, let me just take a look, closer look at these trees. What? Why? Oh. What? You can see there's a hole out here, apparently a size of a, gosh knows what. I don't see a hole, what are you talking about? I don't see a hole. Oh man. What the frick is it? This right here? Yeah, it's just... Yeah, it's been there for a while. If that's what you're talking about. Hey, kitty kitty. Hey, my little sweetie kitty. I know you didn't dig that hole. Yeah. Look, clovers. The clover patch. No chance to find a four leaf though. Yeah, so I'm gonna have to. Yeah, but that, that that's nothing. Well, I thought you meant it was it was a it was a hole about this deep and this big around. No. <laughs> Things only like this big. You're like this. There's a hole this big out there. You might fall into it if you're not careful. Oh, phew, I'm not going to be afraid of a little hole like that. So I was playing a video. So I was playing a video on my iMac here, and um, yeah, it uh, has. I realized it had some really good surround sound speakers. I was playing Windows 7 at it, combined with playing. That's some pretty good stuff. 
Yeah. Yeah, I usually have my headphones on me when I'm watching or editing stuff. But yeah. Hey guys, want to give a quick shout out to these guys right here, the New Hampshire Cla um, Classics Road Channel. These guys do all kinds of off-road videos in the New Hampshire area, and I might give, I mean, I might write a comment one of these days, give them some pointers, because I, I know a lot of Classics Roads in the Stratford County area that I've either been over or never been, or haven't been over, but had but know of. Um... Just killing some time right now watching them go over cl uh, Classics Roads. I like that kind of stuff. So, shout out that. I might link in the description or give put up a video card. I don't know. I'll probably watch the footage and re I'll be reminded by that. But, yeah. Just thought I'd point that out. It's been a few hours and I am in my night clothes. I was, I, I pretty much showed you guys the trees when we cut down. I'll probably do an update on that down there the road um, but it is getting much cloudy right now as the night goes on as you can see out there and I'm pretty much done with today outside um, I might end this video in a, in a little bit here I know it's not much of anything I just want to bring you guys up to date on things and show some stuff but um, yeah I don't know what else I'm going to be filming, but it probably won't be too much because I'm getting tired right now. And, uh, well, I just get to know with, so, yeah. Well, I am done. Uh, to tell you the deal, it's, I think I covered pretty much everything I need to cover. So, that's going to be it. So, I'll be doing more videos like this down the road. More update videos and vlog type of stuff. Um... So yeah, don't forget to um, like, subscribe, stay, t stay tuned for more, and don't forget to peace out.